Hey guys, Tarko Cycle and FEB. Going to do another quick video on the Mobula 7 just to see if we can get this uh, customers to work properly. And one of the things we want to do is if you've gone ahead and made changes in your uh, CLI or in your beta flight to try to do it through the CLI, the binding, uh, here's what I'm going to recommend that you do. Uh, first thing is, let me show you what we're working on here. I'm going to, um, I'm going to connect and I'm going to copy. I'm going to uh, get a dump file of this out. Uh, we're going to have to make sure that if you do this method, you need to make sure you're running the same version of firmware that I've got on here. Now, this is a brand new Modulus 7, but it doesn't mean it's updated. So let me just do a dump file here, and uh, I'm going to copy and save this. And what we're going to look at, first thing we want to look at is, well, when it's done. Okay, there's the end. Let's go to top. All right, so we're running the uh, 4.0.6. Now, you need to get it down to that, and then you can always change it, uh, uh, you know, do firmware flashing. But I'm only going to do this one here. So let me go ahead and do a, um, take this dump file right here, and I'm going to start from here. All right, copy. And I'm going to put it in a notepad. All right, right here, and I'm going to save this one, save as, and we're going to go to, uh, let me see, I'll put this in the software. This won't matter for you guys, but it will um, It will help as far as getting these things done. Then we go to clean flight beta flight configurations, and then we we'll go to beta flight configurations, and then let's do a new folder. Where is my uh, new folder? And we're going to call this one the Mobula. Seven, okay, and then we're gonna go to the Mobula Seven, and we'll name this uh, Mobula Seven Dash F Fly Sky Dash Dump File Dot TXT. Okay, and I'll have this available for you guys to be able to download. Anyways, once you do that, if you have made changes, go over here and just type defaults. When you go to your CLI, sorry, let me start over here. So if you've done that. What I want you to do is I want you to connect. If you, if you have made changes or try to bind through the CLI, I want you to go back and I want you to come over here and I want you to type the word defaults. Okay, go into your CLI and type defaults and hit enter. That's going to reset everything back to the default. The only problem is I don't know what firmware version you have or anything else. So just to be safe, what we're going to do is we're going to take all of these, select all, we're going to copy. And so when you take this, I want you to copy it, connect back, go to your CLI, click paste, that's plain text. Hit enter and let it run. And I left the hashtag lines in there. I'm not really worried about it. Okay, but main thing is make sure that your firmware matches. All right, and again, while this is running, I can show you. Remember, your firmware it needs to be this right here. So you need to make sure you're at this exact firmware like mine so that you know the commands are going to be the same, okay? All right, let me go back here. It's almost done. All right. Uh, it says there was an error detected, and that's going to be a minor error up here. I think I saw it earlier. Whatever. There we go. So, uh, yeah, that's fine. So the resource, these are not a problem. Uh, all right. So once we get down to here, we're going to go ahead and type save. Okay. And once we saved it, now we're back to normal, and we're going to go through the binding process again. So you have the slow blinking lights. So what we're going to do is we're going to unplug it. We're going to um, turn on our radio, press the bind button. Here, let me, there you go. Okay, it's binding. Go ahead and plug in your Mobula 7. Okay, and then to bind it while it's plugged in, hit that bind button that's to the right of the USB. And there it goes, and it's bound right here, and everything's good. And the lights are solid, and we're ready to go. Okay? Hopefully that helps, guys. Let me know if you have any questions. Uh, now it's beeping because of the fact that I have no batteries plugged in, so let me take that off. All right. All right, guys, if you have any questions, as always, please, again, uh, check us out on uh, Facebook, and you can go to our Facebook groups page where you can post any questions you have. And as, also, as always, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Sorry, my phone's going off this morning. Ah. All right. Anyways, I better get going. I'll talk to you guys soon. Be careful. Peace.